of y is equal to x square, 5 units, y is equal to cos x. We shift this graph, pi meter of hyperbola. It is this region. Uh, like this. Then we, so we have here 8 octants depending upon. Okay, now let's find this value. We have limit extends to 0 plus of sin x multiplied by 10x over x square. We have to find the greatest integer less than or equal to this limit. Now this limit is simple. We have uh, limit extends to 0 plus of sin x upon x multiplied by limit extends to 0 plus of 10x upon x. This value is 1, this value is 1, so product is 1, okay. But the problem is this value is 1 minus and this value is 1 plus. So product may be 1 plus or 1 minus in dono me se kuch bhi ho sakta hai, okay. Now how to check whether this value is, uh, uh, this limiting value is more than 1 or less than 1. For that we need to check whether sin x multiply by 10x is greater than x square or less than x square. So what we do? We consider function fx which is sin x multiply by 10x minus x square and we check the nature of this function in some small interval uh, say 0 to pi by 2. Okay. For that we differentiate the function. We find uh, f prime x is equal to cos x multiply by 10x plus sin x multiply by second square x minus 2x. Now we try to figure out whether this is positive or negative to check the nature of the function. It seems difficult. So what we do? We differentiate this again. Now cos x multiply by 10x is sin x. Okay. So double derivative of fx is cos x plus cos x second square x uh, plus sin x multiply by derivative of second square x which is 2 second square x multiply by 10x this minus 2 okay let's simplify we have here cos x plus uh, this product is uh, second x minus 2 okay plus 2 sin x multiply by 10 x multiply by second square x okay now for x belongs to 0 to pi by 2 uh, uh, this is positive okay all sin x 10 x and second square x are positive and uh, uh, this value is always positive uh, because uh, uh, this is root cos x minus root second x whole square. Take it up. I'm completing square method ka concept use kar rahe hai. Okay. So what we find double derivative is greater than zero uh, in this interval. So we can say that function f prime x increases in the interval 0 to pi by 2. So for this interval we have uh, derivative of uh, fx greater than derivative of uh, fx at x is equal to 0. So uh, we get uh, this value greater than 0 because this value is 0. Now you have 0 rakho, aapko, uh, function ka derivative 0 pe 0 milega. Okay? Now f prime x is positive in this interval that means the function fx increases in this interval. So for x greater than 0 we have f of x greater than f of 0. Now f of 0 is 0 so we find this is greater than 0. So we have sin x tan x greater than uh, x square. So sin x tan x upon x square is greater than 1. So for 1 plus this value will be 1 not 0. So we have here one very nice application of monotonicity in finding such. The best part of learning through this videos is that you can learn or revise concepts anytime, anywhere with unlimited attempts. The content flow is in accordance with my J-Advanced books. So if you have bought Sengage J-Advanced books and are unable to understand any concept by merely reading from the book, 
then you can watch that particular concert video on the Sengage digital app and understand it with ease. In and all, I have developed 650 videos of approximately 350 hours.